How long till dinner, Mum? I'm starving. About 30 minutes, Caleb. I think you'll keep. How's that history assignment coming along? It's not really. I'm sure you're further along than you think. Why don't you get your assessment sheet and see what you've got left to do? Hey, Mum. Uh, I'm coming with to the airport next week to pick up Grandma. Hey. No, you're not, sweetie. It's a school day. Dad? Yes, mate? Can I go pick up Grandma too? No, mate. You've got to be at school. But Grandma can come pick you up on Thursday with Mum. You can show your classroom and some of that great writing you've been doing lately. That'd be pretty special, wouldn't it? Yeah, and I can show her where I ate lunch. All the important things, Harry. So, Caleb, do you need me to get some ink so you can print out your assignment tonight? Yeah, it's just... I haven't got much of it done yet. But it's OK, I can always stay home Friday morning, finish it then. History is not on until the afternoon. But what about all your classes? You can't take time off school to finish an assignment. You'll fall behind in your other subjects. Well, that'll be what, two, three subjects for the morning? Yeah, but they're not that important. All your classes are important, even the ones you don't like. Can I stay home on Friday too? No one's staying home on Friday, even for half a day. You need to be at school all day, every day, so you don't miss out on learning. So I can be a pilot one day. So you can be a pilot. And so you can be whatever you want to be too. If you miss just one morning off school this week, you'll need to spend more time catching up next week. Then you'll be stressed and tired, you won't be able to do your best, and the next thing you know, you'll need another day off. It just becomes a cycle. But what if we were sick? then you're not meant to go to school. Well, being sick is different to missing days to catch up on schoolwork, or because you're tired, or because you want to spend time with Grandma. Besides, if you always go to school when you're well, then if you do get sick, there's less to catch up on. And you two have got to set a good example for young Harry here so he doesn't start any bad habits. Kids. Caleb, why don't you go and get some of that assignment done before dinner? All right.